Hey everybody, Ben here with Diesel Power Products, and today we are talking about fuel control actuators, also known as FCAs, or M-Props, or fuel meters. Basically, the thing on the back of your CP3 that tells it how much pressure to make. So, let's talk about that real quick here. This is honestly one of those commonly misdiagnosed items as well. Um, this is the pro tip backyard version to see if your FCA is possibly causing any issues. If your FCA is clogged or it's stuck and it's not allowing the pump to basically build pressure and send it to the rail, one of the ways you can test that is turn the truck off, unplug the FCA, and try and start the truck up. If the truck all of a sudden starts, that's great. That means your FCA may be the issue don't drive it, turn it off. Because once you unplug the electrical connection on this FCA, you have basically commanded all the fuel rail pressure that your injection pump, your CP3, can make. So it's not something you should drive on, it's just a kind of a backyard test to see if your FCA has actually bit the dust or not. Installation is very straightforward. It comes with three bolts and one, and you're just gonna be plugging the wiring harness back into it, and that's it. No reprogramming required, no special tools, just remove the old one, and replace the new one on there. Now, if you're finding that your fuel supply issues are not fixed by this, there are many other commonly failed parts in the common rail system. Could be a lift pump, could be a rail pressure sensor, could potentially be a pressure relief valve, or your injectors are ready to be replaced, or it could be your injection pump. If you have any questions on this, do not hesitate to reach out. We've got a lot of different ways to get a hold of us, and we've got lots of information out there. We've got blog posts, tech, we've even got a podcast. Check out America's Diesel Podcast. There's lots of information on there. But if you want to talk to someone and find out if this is the right part for you and it's going to fix the issue you have going on, our sales technicians are on the phone at 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Pacific time, Monday through Friday, and they're happy to help. You can also uh, do the live chat feature on the website. We've got our social medias. You can email us. Whatever works best for you, we want to make sure you get the right part the first time and the best advice in the industry. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.